afternoon to everyone. I am Alfonso Jaime from Nippon Maritime Display. So for today, we are going to discuss about deballasting or pump out on a vessel. So also we will discuss about ballast water treatment system BWTS using Purimar or the Samsung Maker. So first, let's go back with the basic. So we have here a vessel submerged into seawater. Okay. So for the vessel to have stability, so we have to either load the cargo. So during loading of cargo, we have to do also the deballasting or pumping out. So we are going to pump the seawater in our water ballast tank going to overboard in order to maintain the stability during loading of cargo. So in order to have stability, we have to pump out the water ballast the seawater and water ballast tank going to overboard during loading of cargo. So when we load the cargo hold, so we have to pump out the seawater on ballast tank to maintain stability of the vessel. So first let's go with the basic. We have here the deballasting. We we pump the seawater from ballast tank going to overboard. So remember that during ballasting we already treat the ballast tank. So during deballasting, so we during deballasting we don't need the filter. We bypass the filter using the filter bypass valve. Okay? So during the ballasting, we don't need the filter. We have to use only the, the filter bypass valve. So first, you have to pump the ballast tank, passing to your filter bypass valve, and then going to flow meter, and then going to overboard. But now, before we pump out the seawater to overboard, there is a requirement from IMO that the TRO must be less than 0.2 ppm. So how are we going to maintain or to comply with the IMO requirement? So first, we have here, using the balanced water treatment system, we have two systems. First is the sampling using the TRO, and second is using the neutralizer unit. So Using the TRO, we will know, we, have, we will have the sample, and we will know the TRO. If it is more than 0.2 ppm, it will give signal to the control cabinet. And then the control cabinet will give signal to the neutralizer unit, and then it will inject chemical in order to reduce the TRO to 0.2 ppm. So we have here the sampling and the chemical injection to maintain the TRO to be less than 0.2 ppm. So that is our deballasting system. So we use only two systems for the ballast water treatment system. So next, let's go with the piping diagram. So from ballast tank, we use the ballast pump. So we pump the seawater from ballast tank, pass to flow meter, And then the seawater will be pumped to overboard. But before the overboard, we will have the sampling of seawater. So we took some sample going to TRO. And if the TRO is more than 0.2 ppm, so we have the neutralizer unit. It will inject chemical sodium thiosulfate to our main ballast line. So we have the sampling and the injection of chemical in order to maintain the TRO at less than 0.2 ppm. So very simple, only two systems that we're going to use during the ballasting. We have also the 3D model. So from ballast tank, 
a pump, a seawater, pass to flow meter, and then goes to overboard. So same, you have to maintain that the tailor should be 0 0.2 ppm. So we have here, we do the sampling here, some seawater, we sample the seawater going to your TRO. And if the TRO is more than 0 0.2 ppm, so we're going to inject chemical from your neutralizer unit going to your ballast mainline in order to reduce the TRO to 0 0.2 ppm. So we continue pumping seawater from ballast tank to overboard and then we continue also taking sample going to TRO and we also continue inject chemical from your neutralizer unit until we finish the deballasting. So we have to keep only the TRO to less than 0.2 ppm. So we're only discussing about the neutralizer. So we have here also the neutralizer filling procedure. But for safety purposes, contact the Samsung Maker. This is only for your reference. So first, is we check the valve position of drain and fresh water valve is closed. So number one, we have to close the valves. Number two, arrange neutralizer drum and filling pump near the BWMS neutralization unit. So we have here the neutralizer drum. Be sure that the flexible hose is able to be connected. Number three, connect filling pump outlet nozzle and PVC flexible hose. Connect the connection. Number five, open the neutralizer drum cover and immerse filling pump outlet nozzle in the drum. So you have here the neutralizer filling pump. And six, plug in the filling pump, then filling pump is ready to use. And then number seven, push on button of filling pump. So for more safety, contact your Samsung maker. So that's for today. We discuss about the deballasting or pump up using the Purimar or Samsung maker. And if you have also some question regarding our design, you can contact us at Nippon Maritime Display. We can make also design for your ballast water treatment system. So the implementation will be until 2024. So you can contact our company. We can make the 3D scanning, the 3D model, and we can do also the on-site installation on behalf of the owner. So thank you. If you have some comment, just leave it below and we will reply to you.